I'm so thrilled that I met up with Simona and Aurelia and the whole HubDoc team. As soon as I saw her, that alchemy happened and I knew we had to get together and hold the first school HubDoc event. So I'm really delighted. I was very sceptical about coming here. Think about what you want in life, what you want to do, what you want to be, and then think about what's stopping you from doing that. Sceptical about socialising in, in, in places where I don't know anybody, and so I was very reluctant to come. I was a reluctant guest. It's like walking into a garden that you've never been in before. Infectious, something that I cannot describe. And uh, over the evening as people were speaking, my mind began to change and I began to think about things. When you have a purpose at the right time and the right place, and when you are sur surrounded with the same minded people, an energy radiates like we have here now. And the connections that women form are somehow um, really unique and really special, and I think we have to capitalize on those connections. And if anybody said to me, What is the one quality that girls need to learn? I'd say courage. I think the the biggest thing that I've let go about what I was taught to believe as a girl. Being pretty and girly, pink wearing pink, pink yeah. yeah. <laughs> was that I can't stand here and tell you who I am and what I want and what I feel. I finally learned some lessons I wish I'd been taught age 16. I just did it to myself actually two seconds ago and I need to keep on telling myself that you deserve everything you've achieved because you've worked incredibly hard for it. I learned to talk about my inner feelings. If you do any sort of creative process, you have got to learn to fail. Show vulnerability and open up to people. I failed spectacularly and I learned so much about myself and about life in my failure. And we need to tell each other as women, you've got a great idea, go for it. It is so important for women to encourage other women because there's so few places that we're allowed to get our inspiration from. Women learn from other women and we pick up on each other's energy and we can um, formulate great things together. What can we learn as an older generation from the younger generation? You can be inspired by so many different stories and so many different um, people. I think we can learn that you can talk to someone who's been a polar explorer and you can talk to an artist that has lived in the Caribbean and they both have such worthwhile advice to give you. To have that uh, wonderment about the world, right? Because we lose that. To take advice from everyone at any point. I like that about my girls. Uh, to find beauty in small things and uh, to laugh at things that you just we don't find funny. I like that about them. If you believe that history will always just repeat itself and you do nothing to change it so you do not speak out, you do not tell your story, it will just go round in a circle. If you tell your story and you can reach out to one person, that's why I believe I don't need to reach out to a million people, but I can tell one person and that one person tells another person, I can turn that circle into a spiral and history will not repeat itself.